faster than the fabric of space-time can keep up with it. And it'll just rip. And I'm terrified by this. Get ready for a wild cosmic journey because, believe it or not, nothing lasts forever, not even in the vast reaches of the universe where stars reside. That's why astrophysicists keep a keen eye on the ever-expanding cosmos, making sure they don't miss out on any jaw-dropping changes. And one star that has stolen their attention is Betelgeuse, a red supergiant that never fails to astound them. Using historical records and cutting-edge telescopes like the James Webb Space Telescope, scientists have unearthed mind-blowing facts about this incredibly bright star. One of the most intriguing discoveries suggests that something extraordinary might be happening to Betelgeuse. Welcome to Astro World, where stargazing stories are told. The red supergiant, classified as an M12 star, is one of the largest stars in the universe visible to the naked human eye. In the night sky, it usually shines as the 10th brightest star, but in the constellation of Orion, it takes the second spot, with Rigel claiming the top spot. Betelgeuse stands out with its distinctive reddish hue, and is a semi-regular variable star, meaning its brightness varies between 0 and 1.6 apparent magnitudes. This wide range of variations sets it apart from other first magnitude stars. In the near-infrared spectrum, Betelgeuse is the brightest star in the night sky. Its scientific designation is Alpha Orionis, abbreviated as Alpha Ori. The star's traditional name, Betelgeuse, comes from the Arabic term Yad al jauza which means the hand of al jauza Interestingly, a 13th century error led to the European name Betelgeuse. The launch of the James Webb Space Telescope has provided new insights into this captivating stellar giant. Betelgeuse's immense size is remarkable, with a diameter estimated to be about 1,000 times that of our Sun. To give you a sense of Betelgeuse's immense size, if it were at the center of our solar system, its surface would extend beyond the asteroid belt, engulfing the orbits of Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. The mass of Betelgeuse ranges from under 10 to a little over 20 times that of the Sun, making it one of the largest and heaviest stars known to us. As a result of its massive size, Betelgeuse burns through its nuclear fuel at an accelerated pace, leading to a relatively short lifespan compared to smaller stars like the Sun. Pinpointing its exact distance has been a challenge for astronomers, but current estimates suggest it lies 500 to 600 light years away from the Sun. Despite its great distance, Betelgeuse stands out in the night sky due to its distinct reddish hue, often described as readiness. This color is a consequence of Betelgeuse's lower surface temperature compared to the Sun. While our Sun appears yellowish white, Betelgeuse's cooler surface gives it a prominent red appearance. Scientists have been particularly interested in Betelgeuse due to its advanced stage of evolution. As a red supergiant, it is approaching the end of its life cycle and is expected to culminate in a spectacular supernova event. The exact timing of this explosive event has been challenging to predict accurately. Supernovas are relatively rare and occur unpredictably, adding to the uncertainty surrounding Betelgeuse's fate. A star, the tenth brightest star in the night sky, it has a name that I'm not going to be brave enough to, to try and pronounce, but you might. Apparently it's become 50% brighter. In late 2019 and early 2020, Betelgeuse made headlines when it exhibited an unusually large drop in brightness, sparking speculation about an imminent supernova. The star's dimming was significant, with its apparent magnitude decreasing to around 1.6, making it fainter than its neighboring star, Rigel. This dramatic change caught the attention of both professional and amateur astronomers, and various theories were proposed to explain the phenomenon. One leading hypothesis for Betelgeuse's dimming was that it experienced a massive outburst, expelling material into space and temporarily obstructing its light. Another possibility was the presence of large cool spots on the star's surface, causing uneven brightness variations. Ultimately, it was determined that a combination of factors, including dust formation and convection processes, likely contributed to Betelgeuse's temporary dimming. Since then, Betelgeuse has returned to its usual brightness, and there have been no further indications of an imminent supernova. However, the star's behavior continues to be closely monitored as astronomers eagerly await the spectacular event that will mark the end of Betelgeuse's life. 
When Betelgeuse eventually reaches the end of its stellar journey, it will explode in a supernova, releasing an enormous amount of energy. This explosion will briefly outshine its entire host galaxy and be visible from Earth, even in broad daylight. The resulting supernova remnant will continue to expand, enriching the surrounding interstellar medium with heavy elements forged in the star's core. The exact impact of Betelgeuse's supernova on Earth is difficult to predict. Given its distance of 500 to 600 light years, the effects on our planet will likely be minimal. However, the explosion will offer scientists a unique opportunity to study the physics and aftermath of a nearby supernova, providing valuable insights into stellar evolution and the formation of elements essential for life. With the recent launch of the James Webb Space Telescope, astronomers now have a powerful new tool to study Betelgeuse and other celestial objects in unprecedented detail. The telescope's advanced instruments and capabilities enable scientists to observe distant stars and galaxies with exceptional precision. As the James Webb Space Telescope begins its mission, it is expected to contribute valuable insights into the nature of Betelgeuse and its evolution. By studying the star's composition, temperature, and structural changes, astronomers hope to gain a better understanding of the processes leading to its eventual supernova. When Betelgeuse ultimately reaches the end of its stellar journey and explodes in a supernova, the James Webb Space Telescope will be there to capture the event in remarkable detail. Scientists are super excited to find out what the Betelgeuse supernova will look like from Earth when the star does finally explode. Andy Howell, an astronomer from the University of California Santa Barbara got tired of the numerous calculations, so he put together a pair of UCSB grad students, Jared Goldberg and Evan Bauer. To solve this problem, the two created much more precise simulations of the star's dying days. According to them, it's still not very clear how the supernova will play out, but they did manage to augment their accuracy using observations taken during the 1987 supernova. They think the Earth won't be harmed, but when Betelgeuse does explode, it will shine as bright as the half moon for more than nine months, or their brightness will be concentrated to one point, so it will look like an intense beacon in the sky that would cast shadows at night. It would be hard to miss, and humans will be able to see it during the daytime for at least a year, and by the time it finally fades, Orion will be missing its left shoulder. However, there's almost no chance that the supernova explosion of Betelgeuse will happen in our lifetimes, but, according to the new simulation by Goldberg and Bauer, wherever it happens, a good fraction of the human population will stay up and watch Betelgeuse. It will definitely be a magnificent sight to behold. Meanwhile, Betelgeuse remains an extraordinary star that continues to captivate scientists and enthusiasts alike. Its massive size, distinctive red color, and potential for a future supernova make it an intriguing subject of study. While we await its eventual explosive fate, the beauty and wonder of Betelgeuse serve as a reminder of the dynamic and ever-changing nature of the universe we inhabit. What are your thoughts? Let us know what you think in the comments below. And hey, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Your support helps us reach more people with our content. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more updates.